Hi, I'm Angela Mark P. Walag, a faculty member of the University of Science and Technology of Southern Philippines. For this video lecture, we will be covering an essential mobile application which teachers and assessment professionals can use in checking quizzes and tests that are dichotomous. This mobile application is ZipGrade. For this tutorial, we will be covering the features of ZipGrade as an instructional tool, instructions on how to use it, and tips on how we can maximize its use. ZipGrade is a mobile application compatible with both iOS and Android users. This application can be used to convert your mobile phones or tablets into an optical grading machine to check the Cotomos assessment instruments. This app also comes with a free trial which can be used to check 100 papers per month. For those who want to use the app for bulk checking, you can subscribe for $7 a year. How does it work? When students submit their completed answer sheets, the teacher will hold the phone over the answer sheet, similar to taking a picture. The phone will vibrate once the app has successfully read the answer sheet. What are the advantages of using this app? First, it can check at least 20 papers a minute. There are available printable sheets for 20, 50, and 100 items. If you have a premium account, you can customize your own answer sheet. The scores of students can also be easily accessible within the app. Results as images can also be emailed out to students and even to parents. The website can also generate data and charts and even export raw data for further statistical analysis you intend to do. Also, you can easily make corrections without rescanning. These are the freely available answer sheets. This is how it looks like on your mobile phones. ZipRail also is capable of scanning predetermined ID numbers. You can use this to keep track of students' progress and keep your quizzes organized. You can also print pre-filled answer sheets with ID numbers. Now let's take a look at the ZipGrade website. Just go to zipgrade.com and this web page will appear. In this section, you can choose to create a new account by clicking the new user button or log in if you have an existing account. When logging in, this is what the page looks like. Please enter your email and password. This is the dashboard of your account. You can click the answer sheets button to show the different answer sheets. These are the different answer sheets which you can easily download as PDF or as image file. If you want to customize, you can click this button. For example, here are my customized answer sheets for the different quizzes I made. If you want to make another one, click the new answer sheet button and it will lead you to the answer sheet maker page. Let's go back to the dashboard and check the different quizzes. You can do this by clicking the quizzes button. It will then show you the various recorded exams. If you want to check the statistics of one of your quizzes, click one and it will lead you to this kind of page. Here are the quiz details. The number of answer keys used. This is specially for those with different sets. And this portion gives us the quiz statistics, like the number of papers checked, highest and lowest scores, and etc. This section shows you the graphical representation of the frequency of students versus the scores, while this section shows you the different students and the respective scores. You can even check their papers here. This is an example of an item analysis ZipGrade can give you. Now let's take a look at ZipGrade on your mobile phone. Make sure you have installed it using Play Store or App Store. These are the quizzes recorded on your account. For example, you want to create a new quiz. Click the new button and this will lead you to this page. If you're going to edit the answer key, click this button. On this page is where you can add manually your answer key. You can also scan for the key using a pre-shaded answer sheet. When checking papers, click Scan Papers and this section. Make sure that you align the four corners with the four black squares on the answer sheet. ZipGrade will give you the corrected answer sheet. 
The green signifies the correct item, red for wrong, while orange for the correct answer in the wrong item. If you want to review papers, click this icon. Then you can start reviewing the paper of students and review if there are unanswered items or items with two answers. You can also do an item analysis using your mobile phone by clicking this button. It will give you the item analysis for that specific quiz. Now let's go to tips on maximizing your Zipgrade account. Let's start with self-scan exit tickets. You can ask a local fabricator or a carpenter to design a stand to hold your phone or tablet for a more natural checking. You can also modify the settings to suit your needs, like whether you, can, you want to show the paper on the scan, how long the results are shown, or whether you want to hide the scores of the previously scanned paper. You can also use reusable sheets by laminating them and asking students to use whiteboard markers. And that's it! You are now ready to improve your instructional practices by incorporating Zipgrade in your summative and formative assessments. If you have any questions and comments, you may leave it in the comments sections of this video. If you like it and think that other teachers can benefit from this video tutorial, click the share button below. Thank you.